I've received worldview or quick bird imagery from Digital Globe, and I see several TIFFs in the folder. How should I create one file from all the tiled TIFFs and then orthorectify that image using the RPC information? If you've received data from Digital Globe, it may be a folder that looks similar to this. You may have more than one file folder in the parent folder, but essentially what you'll see are several TIFF images inside the one folder. And this is because of the size limitation of the TIFF format itself. The TIL format indexes all of these TIFF files to put them together into one file so that you can orthorectify using the rational polynomial coefficients or the RPB file. So let's go through that process. Under Manage Data, you can import the TIL file by using the Import Data button. And here we'll change the format to Digital Globe TIL. Select the Digital Globe TIL file. And then the output file will be an IMG. So we can put this in whatever folder we like. It's going into the outputs folder now, and I will choose OK and import all the TIFFs into one file. Once the file is imported, I can close the process list and add in the image. Choose the IMG and click OK. I'll zoom in one to one and then apply a dynamic range adjustment stretch to look at the image in a little bit more detail. Now that I've imported the TIFF files into one IMG, I can transform and orthorectify that data set. And one option to do that is to come under Transform and Ortho and Ortho with a model selection. I can choose from the model list and I will scroll down and see Worldview RPC. I'll select the Worldview RPC and choose OK. The next dialog asks me for the RPC file. I can select File Open, go to the folder, choose the files of type as RPC, and select the appropriate RPB file. Next, it asks me what I want to use for the elevation source for the orthorectification. I'm going to choose a local file and then search for that local file. If you don't have a DEM, you can download one from the internet or there is also a global DEM that you're able to use, and that's in the Imagine, or that's Imagine 2018 ETC folder, and it's under Global Terrain Sources. I can select the global DEM, which is in JP2 format, click OK, and then apply. Next, I'm able to resample to an entirely new image or I can deselect this and simply update the calibration, meaning I'm going to write the mathematical model of the transformation, applying both the RPC and the elevation information to the header. And in this way, I can turn the image, the calibration on or off, depending upon how I want to display it in the viewer. So once we have everything set, I will click OK. Since we're not writing this file completely to a new image, the calibration does not take very long at all. And when I remove this image from the viewer, I save. And then I'm going to add it again. And this time, before clicking OK, I'm going to choose the raster options. You can tell an image has been calibrated by this option right here, Orient Image to Map System. So I can either turn this on to orient the map system and apply the changes with the RPC file and the elevation, or 
without. I'll choose on, click OK, reset this image, and then apply again a stretch so that I can see the image. And that is how I import WorldView or QuickBird data, importing with a TIL file, and then using the RPC information as well as a elevation file to orthorectify the data set.